Hello and welcome back to the channel. This week's Five Facts Friday is going to be a bit more of a five things I wish I'd known before getting a peach face spell clad. So, here's an extra one, they pop holes in your clothes. The first one I'd say is the amount of noise they make. Um, I did a lot of research before getting a peach face lovebird and a lot of place, uh, places I looked said they don't sing like say a budgie would, they more just scream. And I was so excited to get my peach face lovebird, it'll be fine. Played some YouTube videos listening to what it sounds like, it seems quite nice. Um, yeah, it is loud and it is constant and it's when you're on the phone to someone, it's first thing in the morning, so that is definitely something I'd look into more if you're thinking about getting one. So the next one is how that if you react to bad behaviour, and I think this is parrots in general, um, it will encourage it to repeat this behaviour. So I used to be able to stroke my parrot, everything. And then one time I wasn't expecting to be bitten and I said, ow. And ever since that, I can barely even stroke Nacho now. She'll let me kiss her on the back or sometimes stroke her back. But I used to be able to pick her up and fuss her. But yeah, she doesn't let that happen now. <laughs> Turns out Nacho doesn't want to be in this video. <laughs> but you want to talk over it, don't you? So the next thing is that anything of yours is now going to be the parrots. <laughs> Whatever you're eating or drinking, even if I'm on my phone, I'm not allowed to touch it anymore because it's nachos. <laughs> so you've got to be willing to share. It's the only way to get my parrot to be in the video. This is what I was talking about, about everything that is yours is now the parrots. This is now nachos juice. <laughs> is fussy eating. I don't know if this is my lovebird in general or it's all lovebirds or lots of parrots are like it but Natasha is a really fussy eater. She will basically only eat seed mix and millet and some other odd things I give her but she doesn't eat fruit and veg much. She's actually really scared of it. Um, so yeah that is quite a worrying thing so it's a big responsibility to have a love bird. So the last thing I'm going to talk about is mood swings. Um, I did read on, up on this. I suppose you just think your parrot isn't going to be like that. Um, I did also believe that my parrot was a male until she laid an egg and it explained all of the awful behaviour. So that is definitely something you're going to have to get used to. Some days she will love a cuddle or he will love a cuddle. Um, and then the next day she doesn't want to come out of her cage she doesn't want any fuss um yeah lots of tantrums thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on the little bell notification and we'll see you next week for another five packs friday